Welcome and thank you for joining us for this Local Decision 2012 candidate debate. And it might not look much, of, much like a debate because it is just <laughs> myself and one of our candidates. Both the candidates running for uh, Minnesota House 41A were invited to participate here at North Metro TV. Dale Helm has decided to take that opportunity, so we're going to sit down and talk with him this evening. Welcome, Dale, and thank you for being here. Well, thank you for having me, Ben. I appreciate it. It's an honor to be here. Well, why don't we start, and I'm just going to give you an opportunity to introduce yourself. Sure. Um, well, to those voters who haven't had an opportunity to meet me, um, my name is Dale Helm. I am a resident of Fridley, been there for over 18 years. I'm a 21-year military veteran, retired captain of field artillery. Uh, I currently work for Penter Technical Products. It's a business of about 1,400 employees in Anoka, been there since 2000, and I work in safety and security management there. Um, I'm a father, proud father. I have two young boys. Uh, one is going to Woodcrest and one is going to Westwood, and uh, I really love them both. And uh, uh, they keep me young. But um, uh, the reason why I decided to run uh, first time in 2010, getting 46 percent of the vote, was because I felt that the voice of the individual and the voice of our community was getting muted. Um, too many politicians just weren't listening anymore. And the state uh, offices specifically were working in a bubble. And because of that bubble, uh, there was too much reaction and not enough interaction. So I'm running so that our individual voice can be restored so that the voice of our community can be restored again and that we can work together on those issues and uh, come up with the solutions that we want to see. All right. Well, what we're going to do now is, uh, just like we do in our debates, uh, the candidates are given a list of topics before they come into the studio, but they aren't given exact questions. And we devise a, a list of questions, 19 in total, and we'll get through a few of them here tonight. Every okay. debate and every race gets a few different questions than each other, keeps it fresh. Sure. So I'm just going to uh, start by uh, posing some questions to you as I randomly draw, and we'll okay. see what the first question is. First one is about um, working with other uh, levels of government. Uh, as a state legislator, how would you work together with federal, county, and local levels of government to make the biggest difference for your district? Well, actually, I've already started that process. Uh, I made a point of talking with a number of council members as well as mayors uh, for the cities of Fridley, Spring Lake Park, and New Brighton, talking about how I would want to have an interactive relationship. Um, I've also met with the county commissioners and convey that very same message and they're very excited about that and I'm very excited about the opportunities and ideas they gave to me. Uh, I think that as we look to the federal level, we need to make sure that we're first maintaining our state sovereignty on issues and that we're making sure that uh, it's the best thing for Minnesota. But certainly uh, federal interaction is very important and obviously working with the governor is a very important aspect of that. So uh, what I would say if elected this November, what I would like to do is have a town hall meeting, get people together, uh, have them discuss their issues, things they'd like to see, then work with the cities of Spring Lake Park, New Brighton and Fridley, and Anoka County on those. And then after the session, come out and have another town hall meeting and say, okay, here's what we've accomplished, here's what we're still working on, now we'd like your feedback on that and your concerns moving forward. And I think that's a healthy cycle, and we'll get that voice back in, accountab accountability back in, and we'll get those levels of government working well again. Mm -hmm. Dale, I'm going to stop you because we have a decision to make. Danica, oh. you can stop recording because you're